This is a guide to the Flashpoint cutscene maker. Use WASD to move the camera. QZ to change altitude. Hold the right button and move mouse to move the camera target. Hold middle button to change target altitude. Hold shift, control or alt to change movement speed. To edit the next segment, place cursor over it and then move the camera. To add a new segment, click right button over the dialog and select Add New. Press Play to preview. Cutscene is divided into segments, also called moves. There are always two moves displayed in the dialog. Currently active one, meaning the one you edit, has blue background. To switch to the other one, move cursor over other background. Use buttons in the bar to navigate between segments. There are three play buttons. Play only this segment. Play from here to the end and play the whole cutscene. You can stop playback by pressing space. You cannot move camera if the cursor is over dialog. And you cannot use input fields if the cursor is outside lower background. Each segment has seven properties, starting with description which is useful for identifying moves. Next is target type. Camera can target either position or an object. The object can be found in real time. Or it can come from a predefined list. By pressing on the Argos I can freeze units. Position type. It can be absolute, meaning camera will always go to the same coordinates, or relative. Position depends on direction and distance from the target. Camera zoom. I can type in new value, or press plus minus on the keyboard. Camera speed. Condition that must be met before moving on to the next segment. It can be when the camera has finished moving, or a custom code, or just disable the condition. Pause for given seconds before moving on to the next segment, for example. Or I can cut when the camera is still moving. Target, position, and zoom can be disabled. Values are taken from the previous moves. By pressing right button, I have access to the standard batch of options. Cut, copy, paste, and add new segment. I have a simple mission with officer marching into base and then moving out with soldiers. Let's make a cutscene to that. First I press M to move the camera to the base. Freeze units. Change target. First let's have two still shots to establish the scenery.
then I'm going to move the camera towards the officer starting with high altitude I press X to lock axis Z slow camera and condition to finish when officer is near his soldiers and he stopped moving Then I'm going to do close up on the faces. Later I can put here conversation. And condition to finish. And officer is moving out. Because I can't go back in time, I'll have to restart the mission to test it. Two options come handy in this. Auto load and auto play. Rename project. And save. Restart mission. Now, as the soldiers move out, the camera rolls with them. Starting with low field of view. And then camera moves up. And maybe also wait a couple of seconds and change target. Now I'm going to export the cutscene to my script. Let's see how it looks.
and here it is ready for post production scripting let's preview it That is all. Thanks for watching.